Hey guys, um, I just wanted to share something with you. Um, so I've been on dating apps for a while and guys will hit me up, right? And I'll be like, hey, I'm waiting till marriage to have sex. Oh, well, I don't think you should do that, they will say. They'll say, you know, you should have sex before marriage. And I said, no, actually God told me my husband's coming. So if my hu- if God has told me that my husband is coming, why should I have sex before marriage? My husband's coming. So basically, guys will say these things to manipulate, try to manipulate me. And you know, the funny thing is like, I was having a conversation with someone about it on the phone. And when I said, no, actually, I disagree with you. That I don't need to have sex before marriage. And he hung up on me. And when I went to go look at his Instagram profile. User was not found. So ladies ladies and men. Whoever, whoever is actually waiting till marriage. I just want to encourage you. That you do not need to give in to society. You don't need to give in to our culture. You don't need to give in. Just because other people are saying to be to be like them. I don't give a crap what you think because God has told me my husband's coming. And I believe in what God has told me. So you can go and try to convince me that I need to have sex before marriage. But guess what? God, What God has told me is true. And I believe it with all of my heart. And I have faith in God. And so is it hard? Yeah, sometimes it's hard. But is it really that hard? No, it's not. Why? Because to me, if I know my husband's coming, do am I going to sleep with a scumbag? Am I going to sleep with a fuckboy? No. Because I value myself. And I know what I want in life. So if the wrong guys leave, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank God that these scumbags left. Thank God that they don't want to talk to you. Thank God that they ditched you. Thank God they hung up on you. Because you do not need no cockroaches in your life. So I just want to tell you that ladies and gentlemen, if you are someone who is waiting till marriage and someone's trying to convince you otherwise, first of all, You do not need to submit to the world and the culture. Second of all, I'm not waiting because of some religious rule. I am waiting because I know my husband is coming. God has told me that. So it's a gift to wait. It's an honor. I don't feel bad or like I'm being restricted. I don't feel neglected. I don't feel deprived. I'm excited. Because I know what my heart wants is not a one night stand. My heart does not want that. My heart does not want to feel used. I honor my heart. And what what I, what I really want is love. And so I encourage you that if you're waiting, keep waiting. Because, and keep listening to what the Lord is saying to you. God bless you. Bye.